Hey guys, this is Candle, and welcome back to Tomb Raider 2, where we've got to try to find the strong room. Okay, now. There we go. Yeah, we've got, like, very little health, no way to heal up. We're trying to find the strong room. Now, from the best I can figure what I've looked for... Oh, there it is. I was going to say, it's in here somewhere. We've been in here looking for it previously, but I completely missed the lock. I don't know how I did that. Either way, there it is. And, uh, yeah. We now have access to the strong room. It's pretty dark in here, it looks like. Where there is a key here. A red key. Now, where's that one go? That's not where we just were. It's not for where we just were, is it? I don't think so. What's this key called? Rooftop's key. The question is, how do we get there? Where is the rooftops? Basically, we're looking for a red lock, I think. Problem is, where is it? Because I honestly don't know. <laughs> I only looked up where the, the rooftop... Or, uh, where the, uh, strong room lock was. Not the one I probably should have. No, yeah, it looks like that might be red. Yes, it is. Okay, so this is the rooftops. Okay. Nice and simple. We're still missing, what, two, three, uh, two... Prayer wheels, I believe, are still missing. And what we need is health. Basically, taking a look around here, trying to see if we can't find anything. Hello? Oh, why do I have a feeling that's going to be timed? Matter of fact, yeah, I can't lift it back up, so that's going to be timed. There's no way I'm going to make that in time, am I? We have very little health. So, it's like it's not even, yeah, there it is. It's back up. Okay, so before we do this, we want to save. We don't, we don't have to worry about getting uh, the rooftop's key and getting back here. Okay. There we go. Ah, come on. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. So close. I got hung up there. That was so close. Okay. Let's try this again, then. We just passed the second to last one when they, when they came back on and we died. We'll get this. Hopefully only two or three tries, but we'll get this. So, yeah, I've had a, a, a really nice birthday. Had good dinner with my parents. Watched the series and premiere. I thought I pressed that. But yeah. Watched the season premiere of Doctor Who. Uh, by the time you guys are watching this, it's probably on like the third or fourth episode or whatever. But whatever. Um, I got some gifts, which I totally was not expecting. My dad gave me like a, a whole bunch of tools. Like my, my very first tool set and so on. And uh, my mom gave me a vacuum and that may have just screwed me up. Which I, I needed. I've been living in my apartment now for uh, about two months. And I haven't cleaned anything. And I keep... Uh, maybe I can actually... No. Okay. I don't know how I got past that one without getting caught on fire. But yeah, I've been living in my apartment now for like two months without one's vacuuming. Because I didn't have one. But now I do, so... Yeah, 
there's that. <laughs> my my apartment is like almost entirely carpeted, except except for like the kitchen and the bathroom. That's it. That's all that's not carpeted. Now maybe I should uh, focus on getting through here. Not getting hung up on anything. Okay. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Yeah, I knew it. I knew I was going to get caught on fire. Problem is, I don't think I can just keep running and jumping. Laura won't do it. It's funny because there's just certain situations that only come up in games. This would be real easy to do in real life. You'd be able to like step over everything easily rather than trying to hop over it. Instead, we've got to do this. Yeah. Too close trying to hop over it. And you won't. Yeah, you'll just do that. And then when it comes back on, you're screwed. I pretty much, I, th I think maybe I have to press the jump button as soon as I land. Maybe that'll work. I don't know. All I know is that this doesn't seem like it's nearly enough time to get through here. So this really sucks. I'll give it three more tries and then I'll cut ahead uh, until I'm past it. That way you guys aren't just constantly watching me try and fail. Ah, come on. On. Okay. Two more tries. Two more tries, and then I'll cut ahead. This just does not seem like it's enough time. Maybe there's something I'm missing? I don't get it. No. There we go. Forward. There we go. Oh, damn. If it hadn't been for that standing jump, I would have gotten it. Okay. Yeah, if it hadn't been for that vertical jump rather than a jump forward, I would have had it. But yeah, we'll try this one more time, and if I don't get it this time, then we're cutting ahead. Okay, come on. Come on, Lara. You can do this. I know you can do this. Yeah, I have to hop back. Oh, come on. Don't do that to me. Oh, yeah. I'm screwed. I'm screwed. Or not. There we go. Okay. Very lucky there. Very lucky. So what is this way then? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. <laughs> right. Like, that's fair. <sighs> now, for the sake of argument, if this takes me more than a single try, I am going to go ahead and cut ahead until, like, I'm right past the, uh, the fire again. If this takes me more than a single try. There we go. Okay. Took only a single try. Save. 
And okay. Now. Is there a guy up here? No. Nobody up here. Nobody up here at all. And yet somehow, as soon as I start heading down here, somebody appears. Now why is it freeze like that? I don't understand why it freezes like that. And I don't understand where I'm even getting shot from. But it's like they don't spawn in until like right there and then they take a shot at me and there's nothing I can do because I'm dead. Because their shot instant instantly connects. Okay, what if I go over here? No, up, up, up. Let them deal with each other. There we go. Come on, there we go. Good, good, good. Okay. Now first up, we may as well grab this. Secondly. Well, secondly, we should probably save. And while it does that, I have to run to the restroom. I'm sorry. I know I, I kind of just started, but I kind of have to pee. So I'll be back in a minute. Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that. <laughs> when you gotta go, you gotta go. Okay, definitely don't want to just drop there. Although I think I know where that is. I found a prayer wheel like right up in here or something. Anyways, back here. Okay, so there were two monks and two of these guys and hopefully one of them was carrying a health pack. Uh -huh. Uzi clips, okay, but not a health pack. Really need a health pack. Please, yes, okay, it's only a small one, but a small one's better than nothing. Okay, now, what does this do? Whatever it is, hopefully it's not timed. I hate it when they're timed. Okay. Why does this area seem familiar? What is this? Uh -huh. What did I just pick up? Gemstones. Okay. What are the gemstones uh -huh. for? More specifically, where are we? Okay, so that'll take us back up there. Maybe the gemstones open up that uh, star room thing? The, the star door thing? I don't know. I honestly don't. All I know... is that we've done practically everything we can in this little area. Now we have this. Ooh, ooh, they go here, don't they? There we go. Okay, I know where the other one of these goes, too. That goes above the, the statue. May want to save, though. It's always good to be cautious in a game like this. Something major happens, save. Okay, now what's this? Let's try pulling it out. There we go. Then we can go behind the star, I believe. 